Hi there and welcome back to a, a small news update about the channel and about Tyranny. I've frequently stated that I want to play Tyranny and I will as soon as I ha get access to it. Um, you might know I don't get like pre-access pre like some people would with like... Um, yeah, about... yeah. <laughs> like hundreds of thousands of subscribers. But I'll, I'll start as soon as I have the game, so um, stay tuned for that. I, I think all you guys that like Wizardry 8, Pillars of Eternity, um, you'll also probably um, like Tyranny. And also all the guys who, who came here for um, Torment, Tides of Numenera. Tyranny is also a game that is made like in a classic fashion, I, I believe. I've looked at it a bit from the day 9 play um yeah it it got me i think i'm i'm uh, fascinated by the story i'm fascinated by um the looks of it a little bit comic style a little bit yeah arty and a little bit brutal <laughs> so it will be very interesting to role play it that's why we want to play tyranny but um tyranny will not be the main focus of the channel that is still Stellaris, and um, yeah, I want to make some guides for Stellaris. I have some new plans for a research guide that is better than the old one, even that is now like gaining in popularity so much that I <laughs> that I fear to replace it. And um, of course, yeah, daily Stellaris is guaranteed, and on the weekends I'll keep the double episodes. I think I think you like that, and. I like it as well because I'm totally <laughs> into Stellaris right now. Tyranny is just a just a change because I have really a weak spot for the CRPGs of that classic style and and especially the newer ones. As the old ones, I mostly I have played them when I was very young. <laughs> so I don't really want to replay them because I've played them so often. Yeah, it it might be interesting, but it will not be a real role play. It might be more like a walkthrough or something like that. And there are enough walkthroughs of that. So I'm really um, keen on playing Tyranny with you. I hope you, you see it the same. I'll, of course, if there's no voiceovers, I'll, I'll read it out um, as, as good as I can, like <laughs> playing it out a little bit <laughs> with my voice. And... Um, yeah, I've changed the the uh, the schedule for Wizardry 8 and Pillars of Eternity as well, as there are, I think, quite some viewers who like both games. So I thought like I I'd have a schedule that is that is easier to remember as well. So just every second day, <laughs> every second day. Um, with V8 and every first day Pillars of Eternity or vice versa. That's it. And maybe I'll also make some with V8 guides. But guides are always a thing that is, um, yeah, it's really time intensive. Uh, the Let's Play episodes, I also have to do something with them. Like I'm, I'm writing basically a vlog. After each episode, I note down what I did and... I want to do that with Tyranny too. I want to like link you up the quests with the hashtags so you can if you are in search of a quest you can just click the hashtag in the description and then you will get all videos from me about that quest in Tyranny. So that's something I want to do. Um but that's really a lot of time too. So um basically you're if you're playing the the role playing games in that fashion that you you after note something, then you you would have like at least a third of the time playing, or at least half I would say is um, yeah the 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 remastering, the descriptions, the titles, the the quest uh, database, so to say. I want to make for for the playthrough, um, and it will be a role play playthrough, so not focused on optimal play but if there's a like a normal uh, easy hard and insane mode 
I want to choose the hard mode. I think it can be done well, even in a first playthrough, if you're okay in uh, role-playing games in general. And I think I'm quite okay with that. Like, I'm not the, the super big power player, but I mean, I can I can live with Path of the Damned in Pillars of Eternity. So I'm I'm not really bad either, right? <laughs> But that, that will be done on hard and it will be a roleplay thing, not, not for the optimal result, but for our character. And yeah, the character I want to just develop, um, that's, that's a spontaneous thing that time. Like, we'll, we'll see what, what will come out, what <laughs> inspiration uh, I'll, I'll have on the day I, I had access to the character building. That's the day when I'll I'll make the character. It's not like in, in Stellaris where I'm reading all the dev diaries that I also want to show you and stuff. Yeah, I, I already said that the channel is like the focus is still um, mostly Stellaris and then these role playing games. They are also a focus in itself. They are also in really really interesting. Like from a tactical sense, from from a story sense, of course, because they all have great stories. Wizardry 8 has also a great story. It's it's a little bit more mechanical than the other games, like Pillars of Eternity, Torment Tides of Numenera, or maybe Tyranny. But yeah, they, these newer games are more focused on the story elements. So it's, it's even more fun to play them um, in a fashion that is role play. Like Wizardry 8 is it's okay for roleplay, but um, it's really done better in the newer games. There, there are more possibilities for that. You didn't, you didn't need that much roleplay um, earlier on because, like, there was everyone having the D and D group, pen and paper, and there you could roleplay. But now it's increasingly difficult to to uh, have people find the time. At least for me. Uh, it's difficult to find the time to uh, get these people together for a pen and paper group. And so <laughs> I'm turning to these games here. Um, it's really hard if you're the organizer usually. And yeah, that's that. So um, stay tuned for Tyranny that is coming. I'll have as many episodes as I can. The first time it, it may not be like daily, but it... Um, I'll do my best. Later, I'm 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 aiming for daily, or at least five times a week, and guaranteed on the weekend, like that. I mean, it must be doable for me. So I'll I'll just find out if I can do that. So um, I hope you like the changes. There's basically more for you to watch, <laughs> and um, there's no, don't, no there's no more holds in the in the schedule, which means like. Uh, you'll have three videos a day, basically, and four videos on the weekends. So that's that's like, I think I cannot, <laughs> I cannot uh, really do more um, at the moment. As yeah, the financial income from YouTube is not that not that high with with the number of views we have. Um, so so I have to work. <laughs> <laughs> and I have to support my family and all kinds of stuff like that. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about. But I'm enjoying the time with you guys, with the comment, comments and, and all all kinds of contacts I have, the ideas you give me. And because of that, um, because of that, I, li I like <laughs> putting the load a little bit up even more like with with the tyranny addition to the to the schedule so i hope you like it and um yeah thank you for watching this i hope you have a good time and uh, see you in the next video happy gaming to you <laughs>